the heck is going on? All right, so windows died down. Very nice black interior, if you see that in there. I love how they have a nice big screen there. Obviously, it could be a bit bigger. I love the seat design, leather seats, and of course, you got all this space in the center console. Perfect. Don't have a moonroof, though. Back seats, a lot of room. So let's see what we got here. If you guys can see that, they want 68000 for this truck. I'm sure it's a D-Max. Yep, and it's a Z71 off-road package. So look at these tires. Now, if I were to guess, these are Terra Grappler Wrangler. No, 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 that's what it was. Goodyear Wranglers. Goodyear Wrangler tires. These are pretty aggressive tires, I'd have to say. And uh, 275, 65, or 18. So yeah, that's basically what I have on the Silverado now. But of course, those have a lot more treads, so they might look bigger. But damn, that is such a nice spec. Man, they need to start raising the heights and putting bigger tires on these, though. Gosh, I love the love the cab light look, and the vent in the front, black bow tie, beautiful. So right here, we also have a nice truck here, but this is a four-wheel drive pro edition. Like I said before, they're selling a ton of these all the time now, and I see them all the time. So these are definitely, uh, what do we got here, a 35, uh, 35, 12.5 R20 and fuel wheels. Got the Bushwhacker fender flares. No tint on the window. It is open. So let me just step in here for a second. This is where I should have conducted the analysis of my truck. Let me close the door. But yeah, I love I love all the features that they have here. And the steering wheel, new design. Definitely a nice material. They don't have the moonroof on this one either, but look at all that, man. You got so much, and you still have a third seat with all that space. It's beautiful. And then down there, Things pretty pretty spacious gotta love that a lot of foot room so even though there's not too much going on here there's still a lot because you got the touch screen and of course you gotta love the height of these trucks look at that we are sitting so high compared to that d-max gosh man i can only imagine and look at the hood design gee whiz so this is a 2017 and then i think we got another one over there but that has black bumpers in the back and the front so let's go check that one out. Ooh, hit the bush. My bad. So yeah, check it out. Four wheel drive pro, black bumpers. Check that out, man. What do you got going on? Oh, it's got a grayish interior. I'm not too much of a fan of that. They don't have the touch screen, and if they do, that's a very small one. Not too much of a fan of that. But four-wheel drive pro edition, I'm sure these are 35. Well, it is the work truck edition truck, isn't it? So this is probably the cheaper way to get a lifted truck if you don't care about all the amenities and you're actually going to off-road it. 35-12-5 R20. So that is such a sick truck, man. The height of these, look at that. What kind of lift is it? I can't tell. But well, maybe you can tell by the shocks. I don't know. They look like they're stock shocks, but you can tell it's a spacer lift. I'm not sure how old this one is, but it's still a nice truck. They definitely took a base model work truck through a lift and nice fuel wheels on it. Holy cow. And yep, zone lift kit. So it's probably a zone six inch, zone six and a half inch lift. Not really sure. It's still a nice truck though. Gosh, man. The truck is so sick. America. There we go. We got this black one over here. Wood serene tires. These tires look pretty big, but nope. It's still a 35-12-5R20. It's always the trend. Always. And what we got? Zone. So we got another zone lift truck. It's the lift I'm thinking about going with. Weird tent on it. Not high quality enough. I can see that it's bluish kind of. It's weird. Forward drive custom pro edition. So this is a 15. I love these body styles too. They're sure gonna be changing them up every few years gosh man it's so square that's what i loved about it when i first came out gives such a square appearance man this is a nice truck bro bushwhacker fender flares i know there's a whole market out there for black trucks come pick this one up man it's nice and i apologize for the heavy chrome and two-tone color truck lovers but this has to be my least favorite truck out of all of them. These tires, I think, are a little bit bigger. I remember doing the calculation before. This is 325 60R20. I think it may be closer to a 36. 
it's either that or they're a little wider tread is kind of getting low if you guys remember in a long-term followers of my channel i had chrome rims and bf goodrich all-terrain tires similar to these and it was nice and all but the tread ran down pretty quickly i mean i bought them used anyway so pretty nice interior though i do like it it's got a two-tone interior look so this is definitely for your two-tone truck lovers out there and it's a badlander edition so i'm sure it's just a aftermarket edition though and then it says tusk tuscany on the badge so yeah it's an aftermarket design it's a pretty nice truck but like i said i'm not really a fan of what they've got going on here but it's still nice it's got a pro comp lift shocks are starting to really rust bad i like how the exhausts are painted black already that's actually pretty cool and you can tell it's been painted after because this is corroding really bad it looks sticky but yeah pro comp lift so six six inch lift i'm sure got some decent wheels i don't know how long this is gonna sit i think you guys are probably on my side of this one that this is not the nicest one as you can see that was that was easily coated over after i don't even know how this is a 2014 and you can see that they coated over a lot of corrosion even the spacer so that's why this is my favorite one but i mean hey it's still a nice truck i'd say my least favorite thing about this truck would be the grill so i'm now down in the used section a little bit farther down and i've always loved this color of the silverado you never see it too often but when you do see it it's it honestly is a nice sight to see i love this color man i do love a blue truck but honestly this is really nice look how shiny that is gosh i gotta wax up my truck it's been a while yep same exact interior to be honest that's exactly what my truck looks like on the inside of course they detailed it all and got it all looking spiff and spam yeah this is what the front end of my truck looked like too chrome grill chrome piece down there i got the silver i didn't have the tow hooks i had a grill guard and pick this one up it's certified look at that it's actually the same year and everything so i'll move it down here because i want to check out this one truck. oh my gosh they got an f-150 here somebody came in with a ford and said you know it's time to go shabby oh it's nice and open nice let's get in here oh wow how old is this this truck cannot be that old and it's 143,000. it's a 2017. oh my gosh they must have lived in this thing literally they don't got too much going on here a lot of buttons not my favorite and of course oh it's not the cleanest in here but it is pretty nice this is huge this whole area here is a lot bigger than my silverado got a lot of room in the back i do like the design on the sides this is really nice this has always gotten to me really do like that very big steering wheel a lot everything is a lot bigger that's what i have to say about the inside of this truck everything's a lot bigger the gauge clusters don't look too modern to me for a 2017 i feel as if they should be a little bit better i'm not bashing on ford here i do love these trucks the outside of these trucks look amazing got a usb port perfect and just got the normal normal uh, knob right here for four wheel drive no moonroof in this truck but i must say it's still a nice truck and you got a nice tray right here that's perfect so let me get out here that's really cool i do like that the screen's kind of small so let me see if they have any pricing on this no foot thing no foot thing all right i do love the design the i got to give it to ford the design of the new fords super duties i love them so much what it went with a paint painting bedline on that as you can see that's frozen let's see what we got i don't know vehicle identification number warranty for this vehicle eight grand it doesn't say anything about the price but i'm sure they don't want too much being a high mileage all right guys so we're getting to the end of the lot here at least for the used section they have a huge new section it's ridiculous but check this out i'm pretty sure i know the guy who owns this truck and he has the name of kyle i'm pretty sure i've seen him put all this stuff on like that is nice could have done a little bit better on the wrap job it looks as if the emblem was actually white before is this a whole plate that they put on i'm not really sure but it is fading out that's why i want to get this professionally painted on my truck at least got a plastic liner in there so what kind of tires are we running i do love the stance i'm thinking that's probably a negative 25 offset we got 275 65 r20 so i'm not really sure on what size that is maybe a 33 maybe a little bit bigger i'm not really sure looks as if they painted the inside of the well and it's chipping very bad that's why you got to do a bed liner and then put a cover over that obviously the frame is not coated 
shock wise rough country premium shock absorber and three that is a huge drive shaft that is it's so thick holy crap i never noticed that so it looks as if it's stock exhaust that's the huge muffler that i used to have in my silverado let's see what we got they have a warranty on it tinted windows so i think they have the inspection down there i think it's locked yeah so it's a 2500 HD, it's a Vortec. I thought he had a D-Max, so maybe he, maybe this isn't his truck, I'm not sure. Um, what do we got here, X-Series wheels, not too bad, not too shad. And of course that, that looks awful, I think that's right.